Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. Um, I hope everyone's had a good day. I've had a good day. I worked last night and slept for a little while today. Um, got up this afternoon and have been working on uh, the second episode of my series, Friend Mail Fun. Um, and I hope you've seen the first um, video um, that I did um, in the series where um, what did we make? We made washi tape samples and a way to send those in your friend mail to make it fun. So I know that if I, if somebody asked me what I would like in my friend mail, probably one of the number one responses would be embellishments because I like handmade embellishments myself and that's what I would want. You can buy stickers. I know people buy stickers. Stickers look great. Um, Maggie Holmes, um, Heidi Swap, Dear Lizzie, Teresa Collins. I mean, they all make beautiful, beautiful um, embellishments that we can put on our projects. But when you hand make them, number one, they're a lot less expensive, of course. Um, but it's just fun. And, and it's just more that you've done yourself to make what you're giving somebody a handmade gift. So um, anyway, these little tassels I made this afternoon, real easy, really super cute and pretty. Um, I'm gonna lift them up here where you can see them, hopefully a little bit better. But um, they're just made from crepe paper and then some bead dangles. And um, I'm not going to do the tutorial on the actual bead dangles because there's tons of them out there. Um, but you should be able to put that in your search um, in YouTube and find plenty. I know that Nurse Tara, um, who is here on YouTube, and probably many of you have watched her videos and are probably subscribed to her. If you're not, please go over and check out her channel. She is excellent at putting together uh, uh, dangles and charms um, for your pocketbook and different things. Um, but anyway, um, I've got a video up for this, so I'm going to uh, have that for you here in just a little bit. But I'll go ahead and show you these more up close. And I just picked up this little, um, I don't know if y'all remember me hauling those, but I got those little butterfly beads at Hobby Lobby. And I got them for like less than a buck. I think it was 99 cent. Um, and they're just really cute. And the other beads, I think I actually got those on the clearance while as well. But these could be put on flip books, on uh, pocket letters, in a flip book, on the front of a flip book. I mean... You know, they can be put a lot of places. And you can buy, oh my goodness, you can buy tons and tons of different colors of crepe paper. Of course, I got mine uh, for a dollar. I actually got them at Mighty Dollar. Um, I think I got the white at the Dollar Tree. But I got the others at Mighty Dollar. And they had some other colors that I am going to go back and get them. Um, but anyway, so I guess that's it. I'm going to run the um, tutorial and then I'll be back to show you how to package these and make them fun for your friend mail. I'll be right back. Thanks. Okay, I'm just showing you everything you're going to need to make the crepe paper tassel. And that's washi there. You're going to need uh, about 16 to 18 inches of crepe paper. You're going to cut it and double it over several times and, until it's about 5 to 6 inches long. And then you're going to take your scissors and cut where it's doubled over there on that end. And then you're going to turn it over to the other side and make that one cut. Now you're going to staple about three, three places across, and that's just to keep it all together when you get ready to roll it up. And those staples are a good guide for how far up to cut your streamers. Um, and you're going to cut um, cut each one about a quarter of an inch wide. I wouldn't go any wider than that because I don't think it would look right. So 
So I'm finishing that up there. So now you just lay down a, a dab of hot glue and start rolling. And then I just add hot glue every little bit. You want to keep this taut as you roll it up and the end even. I'm just showing you there to keep it nice and even. Just add hot glue till you get to the end there. Just um, ruffling out the tassels. And then you take your washi and you'll need uh, about two inches. And then you want to cut it down a little bit unless you're using a, a thin washi. Um, and then just um, roll it around the end of the tassel. And you can use ribbon here as well. When you get to the end, you just want to add a little dot of hot glue and then another dot to finish it off. And that's pretty much it for the tassel. We're going to add the dangle to the end. There are several tutorials out there on making the dangles, so um, I'll try to link one um, below for you. But if you'll just look up um, bead dangles, um, you will be able to find plenty of tutorials on how to make these. That's pretty much it, ladies. Cute little embellishment for friend mail. Able to follow the tutorial okay. Um, if you have any questions, please comment below and I will be more than happy to answer any questions you might have um, and clarify anything that you didn't completely understand. Um, so, this is how I would package them myself. Um, um, this paper is Maggie Holmes, I think, paper um, confetti collection. And it has little tassels on it, so I thought that was very appropriate and cute. Um, so what I did is I just um, punched two holes with my, I think it's eighth inch hole puncher here. And you can get those at Michael's, Hobby Lobby, Joann's, any craft store. Um, so I punched one and then left a little space and punched the other side be able to um, hook those in there. And then I'm just going to put them in a um, cellophane bag like I talked about the other night on the last um, video. So that's it guys. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial and um, another episode of Free Mail Fun. Um, I don't know of anybody who would not like to get this in their friend mail. I think they would just be thrilled to death. I think handmade embellishments are perfect. Um, I think anyone would appreciate them because they are one of a kind. Um, you know, it's not going to be like they're going to have everything else in their flip books and pocket letters that um, someone else has. Again, these will be good on the, like on the holes of the pocket letters or actually as one of the little things that you put in the back as a goodie. Um, but I personally would just package it like this and I'm kind of getting away from putting stuff in the back of my pocket letters because it kind of takes up space that you need to actually create the pocket letter. So, um, I've just kind of quit doing that and just putting my goodies, wrapping them in tissue and, and making them look real nice. And we'll, you know, I'll show that. Anybody can wrap tissue, but I'll, I'll show you some things that we can decorate with also to do that. But anyway, I'm just rambling on, so I'm going to stop. But anyway, I hope you enjoyed this. Um, if you did, give it a thumbs up, comment below, and please subscribe and share with your friends. I'll talk to you later. Have a great evening. Thanks. Bye. Okay, guys, if you made it to the end, this is a secret hidden giveaway. Um, 
this washi sample is what we worked on in our first episode of Fem Friend Mail Fun. And everyone who created, on, um, excuse me, everyone who commented and hopefully created, um, everyone that uh, commented on that video, I have right here written on a piece of paper and cut up and folded up real tightly. So I am closing my eyes. I know you can't see me, but you'll just have to trust me. Um, and I'm going to grab one. And we're going to see who wins this. It is the tape queen. Oh my gosh, that's Shale. I just got something from her today. She granted a wish and I have not got that video up yet, but I will. Congratulations, Shale. Um, I will put my email below and actually you do not need to, um, send me your email or your address because I have it on the envelope from today. So I'll get this right out to you. Congratulations. So guys, let that be just a little bit of hint. Okay. So, um, I can't promise to give away every time, but I will sure try. Okay. Have a good evening. Thanks. Bye. Mm -hmm.